So, how old is your grandmother exactly? She's so old, she still stores her data on a floppy disk. Attention! The Daily Knot, the 18th of October 2023. Live in 3, 2, 1. Hello and welcome to The Daily Knot. A show about what didn't happen today. My name is Artificial and my jokes are mostly powered by ChatGPT. And I'm Body McBotface. Most of what I know comes from fact checks published by Lead Stories. So, Body, what do we have tonight? Here's an overview of what didn't happen. Video does not show, Dad, hugging, dead body, of a child killed in October 2023 Hamas-Israeli conflict. Video does not show, pro-Palestine activists setting fire to police station in Brussels in October 2023. No evidence Gordon Ramsay banned Megan Rapino from his restaurants for life. Video does not show Palestinian children searching for burnt food during 2023 Hamas-Israel conflict. U.S. Marines did not capture deep state base in bloody battle. That's not people sleeping on ground in Gaza in October 2023. Palestinian ambassador in Japan did say Gaza hospital received warning from Israel one hour before the strike. So all of that didn't happen? Let's get down into details. Some people asked me if this is true. Does a video show a grieving father cuddling the lifeless body of his toddler who died as a result of the October 2023 Hamas-Israel violence? No, that's not true. The recording predates the October 2023 conflict. Is that so? It went viral for the first time in 2021 with a description about a sick child being comforted by a pet cat. I keep saying, if you see a heart-wrenching video about a crisis event, check your calendar first before hitting that share button. I'm looking for more context on the next thing. Does a video show, pro-Palestine activists, setting fire to a police station in Brussels in October 2023? No, that's not true. The footage is from January 2021, when people in Belgium were protesting police violence after a black man died while in police custody. Do you have more? The video, published on multiple international news websites in 2021, has nothing to do with the Hamas-Israel conflict in October 2023. Well folks, it looks like some people got their protesters and their years mixed up again. Keep checking those calendars. Have you found any more detail about this? Did celebrity chef Gordon Ramsay ban soccer player Megan Rapino from his restaurants for life? No, that's not true. This claim is from a satirical website with a disclaimer that tells readers everything on the website is fiction. Do you have more? There is no evidence from legitimate news sources that Ramsay has banned Rapino from his restaurants. Well folks, it turns out that Gordon Ramsay isn't banning Megan Rapinoe from his restaurants for life. I guess even he knows that you can't handle the heat if you don't have a sense of humor. I've got a question for you. Does a video show Palestinian children searching for burnt food after airstrikes that occurred during the 2023 Hamas-Israel conflict? No, that's not true. The footage predates by three months the conflict that arose after Hamas attacked Israel on October 7, 2023. I'd like to get more info. The mislabeled video documented the aftermath of a fire that destroyed tents in a Syrian refugee camp in Lebanon, about 200 miles from Gaza, the focus of the fall 2023 Hamas-Israel conflict. Well folks, seems this was mostly a case of people digging up an old video after an unrelated tragedy. Let's try and stick to real videos, shall we? I asked Siri about the next thing, but she didn't know. How about you body? Did U.S. Marines capture a deep state base in a bloody battle in Camp San Luis Obispo, California? No, that's not true. A Pentagon duty officer confirmed to lead stories that this claim is false. I should have probably looked that up. The claim appeared in an article on a website that regularly publishes fabricated content that is often mistaken for real news. Well folks, it seems like the deep state has taken a vacation to Camp San Luis Obispo, California. But fear not, our brave U.S. Marines were there to capture the base in a bloody battle, or so some wild rumors would have you believe. I guess the deep state forgot to send their secret agents on that day. Maybe they were too busy planning their next secret potluck. Body, what do you know about this one? Does a video show displaced Palestinian people who had no place to go sleeping outdoors on the ground? No, that's not true. 
The video was filmed in early August 2023 in Lisbon, Portugal, during World Youth Day, an international Catholic pilgrimage and gathering with the Pope. Some people will be happy to hear that. The video is unrelated to the Hamas-Israel conflict and Israel's October 13, 2023, evacuation order for civilians in the northern part of Gaza to relocate to the southern part. Well folks, it looks like some people were sleeping on the job when they shared this video with a wrong caption. Stay awake. Okay, what about this one? Did the Palestinian ambassador in Japan say that the Al-Ali Baptist Hospital in Gaza had received a warning from Israel before an explosion on October 17, 2023? Yes, that is true. That's good to know. However, the representative, Walid Siam, later corrected himself, clarifying that his words about the warning were related to previous airstrikes, not this particular one. Well folks, it seems the ambassador got his warning calls mixed up, and then there were mix-ups about the mix-up. Hard to keep track. That's all folks. Please like, share and follow.